So, how's Anya? I'm good, Tim. I'm eager to hear what you're doing. I kind of just took a glance at the photograph that we were given of the raven. And you look like a raven yourself today. Well, I tried to. <laughs> <laughs> it just kind of occurred to me that this one was based off of the texture of the bird. Mm -hmm. And then this I said the, the shape. The three words we were given were seductive, smoky, and dramatic. I thought there would be go a good risk for me to take to try and do something seductive and dramatic that wasn't my usual showing a lot of skin and, and flowy and all of the rest of it. How is this keeping its shape? It's, it's wool and it's very stiff. All right, because do you see where the, where the breasts are? Do you see how uneven it oh, is? Oh, yes. That, I think that's also because I've just pinned these okay. in. Okay, okay. So it's not, it's not yet. I only say that because when you have a, have a, a, a piece that is this sculptural, yes. it needs to... Be perfect. Yeah. yeah. It needs to really be perfect. Yeah. Personally, I'm ambivalent about that seam allowance. Okay. But I want to tell you this about the shape. I think the shape is superb. Oh, thanks. I, th I find it very exciting. Can you turn it around again? Yeah. Do you want to see the profile? Yeah, I love the profile. Can I see it from the back? Yeah. It's really intriguing. And I kept and the point at the end. It's, it's very bird-like without being It is, overtly without so. being literal. Yeah. Well, you still have a lot of decisions to make. You'll yes. make them during the fitting. I will. But this has got to be perfect. Okay. And when you say well, your, your concerns right now are it falling it's, symmetrically? It's the asymmetry of it. Okay. In the front and in the back. Okay. All right. Okay. Eager to see how this evolves. Thank you. Me too. <laughs>